All right, welcome or welcome back, everyone. Got the U Gears mini biplane. Like I said, covered a little bit yesterday. It's only 84 pieces. Made for eight and up, so I'm hoping it'll be a fairly easy build. Sort of a, as I usually do, a nice little uh, palette cleanser after a complicated build. Build, but uh, uh, done a couple of smaller U Gear sets before, but I don't think I've ever done like a model like this. So I'm intrigued to see how it works out. Um, I don't know. I think I'm trying to remember the ones I have done been like the uh, the the oh I had a fidget toy and like the uh, little. Uh, well, uh, uh, there was a couple of little ones. I can't really remember offhand. Rubber bands and some wax. Instruction. Actual booklet. It's not. A, I was expecting a, a folder for that, or a, a folder, a poster for that. So that's good. Y'all know I like the books more than if I do the posters. And our. Anything else in that? No, what's in there? Got some sheets. Which one? Other way. <clears throat> got our oh, uh, let's just go here mm. yeah only four sheets should be pretty simple I think that's uh, ought to be doable and like I said, I'm thinking one or two days I don't I'm not expecting this to be a massive drawn out three week build like the last one was and I <clears throat> I've got a few things lined up, so I'm, uh, you know, we're going to have a good little variety over the next couple of weeks. So that ought to be fun. I think actually this is small enough. I can, I can, I can make them all fit one frame. <laughs> eh, most of it. <laughs> and that is a little bit more. But there all the pieces are. But anyways, I'm going to pull off the first couple of steps and be right back with that all right here we go first step of our next project pretty straightforward right off the bat getting these guys I always forget how stiff it is to get the uh, year stuff started they are engineered to very precise <laughs> measurements I would say that one on there then Gear through the middle and it's on the other side is supposed to go yep all the way down all right and then here in a second we'll get out the old Impressa wood lubricant uh, I use instead of the wax and it because it's got to go on these act as bearings and, uh, Sony's trying to sell me something so let me Mute that. Okay. Now, next step, need you and you. And oh, no time like the present. Hop into our wood lube. And it goes. I, I like to do the inside of these better and, and around the, a little bit on the outside just to, if there's any friction there on the edges make sure everything spins and like a little maybe a little excessive on the inner part <laughs> and like this nope like this yeah this guy goes in here and have a quick spin and this one goes on top of it there Either said to done <laughs> from this angle. Okay, there it goes. Give that a quick spin. And you can see I've already got some of the extra lubricant on my gear there. <laughs> okay, now bring in these and pretty much another and you 
maybe go the other way. Like it should be going through. Mm. Ah, okay, that matters which which way or in whether it'll go through or not. <laughs> and you on there, and you go over here. So you're gonna end up. Hmm. Got a sliding. That's wasn't expecting that. Okay. <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen one with slack in it like that. That's different, but that's definitely where it goes. So let's throw some lube in there. Around the edges. That might be a little excessively excessive. So I'll take some of that off. <laughs> It works, so <laughs> As I, had to, I don't think I've ever had that that situation before. Cool. Now we got our plate. On this side. This way and that way. Oop. So get out. Oop. And in here and more in here. Let's <laughs> go around like that. So extra on this surface because it's going to be on the inside. So I'm just going to hit a little everywhere there. <laughs> Hold it steady, it would all still spin. Yeah. Alright, yeah, there they go. Now, this guy. Yeah, these guys go here and there and there. I've got them all, yeah. So. Everybody seated in all the way. And we got. Okay, so it's gonna. It spins one way, spins, and it locks it down the other way to go the other way. Cool. That's interesting. I can't wait to see what that's for. <laughs> That may be a clutch mechanism or something. Hmm. Okay, so that's that piece completed for the moment. So I'll move over to this one. And <coughs> these guys go all the way down. <laughs> And the teeth all line up how we want it. And it says we're going to put lube on these teeth. So, But I'm going to wait and see where it ends up first. <laughs> well, we're about to... <laughs> we're about to go ahead and put that on. So it's time to lube the teeth. Ok, 
Okay, you go there, and you go on the side into that. Now you should turn. Yes, you good. Make sure to get all lubed up properly. <laughs> I still like I like the motion there, and I'm pretty I'm pretty sure that'll end up being a clutch mechanism to something to hold it in place when we wind our propeller up. Maybe we'll find out together. <laughs> and let's see here. Okay, Jim Harbaugh is the coach at New York to the Chargers. <laughs> I don't know why they won't tell me about that. I'm not a Harbaugh fan or a Chargers fan, <laughs> but sort of. It is what it is. Let's see. And for all my international anybody not in the States, that's sort of a big deal, but not really. <laughs> These guys go here. Here. And Everything's still spinning nicely. Cool. And got our back plate, looks like. You go. End up. Mm -hmm. I was trying to figure it out without peeking. Peek, 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 like this. Yeah, yeah, there you go. So we got these guys. Yeah. Wait a second, that No. <laughs> I'm holding the they turned it upside down on me when I wasn't looking like this, yeah. <laughs> so Yeah, this that's where I'd do it. All line up in there. Stabilized and all right. And that's all the pieces I've pulled, so I'll stop there and pull a few more. <laughs> okay, now the next couple of pieces are these two, and we got this one. here to here I have I believe I found a good stopping point for later on I think I know about where I want to end mm, that's not going to cooperate One bad thing about the being so why is it crooked? <laughs> Get that in straight, maybe this will pull in. It feels not good to do that. Okay, there it went. <laughs> little extra force required there. I think that still looks a little crooked more. Okay, there it went. Now it's flush. <laughs> or flushish. <laughs> Stripped a little veneer off there on the edge. But, okay, and then on the bottom, you you make sure I got that. Yeah, yeah, that's right. <laughs> no, it's like, yeah, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, that right, because I want these two. <laughs> to, yeah, okay. Let's see if this cooperates any better on this end. Mm. 
one does not. Okay, there it went. Just got to have it lined up exactly perfectly. And that got okay, about right. This thing's still spinning on the inside. That's good. <laughs> All right. And next, we get to bring our rubber bands into play. Just pretty straightforward, just loop it through like so. And I didn't pull enough pieces, I forgot to pull one. Okay, To the drawing board. <laughs> These guys through there and into one pair of holes. Now hopefully hold the rubber band in place <laughs> and do it again. Oops, get in there. Oh. Oh, just a little bit. Okay, one needs to come. Okay. Yeah, I think they're about right. Okay. Now, like this guy, and you go into the center drive shaft here. And I think I can actually <laughs> my Lego toy is enough to Just had another thought. Okay, that started. Now, ease us back off a second. All right. Gonna be a lot of surface contact right around there, so gonna get some lube in there. I want to make sure I got every chance to let this propeller spin as free as I can because I, th I feel like this is going to definitely going to be the drive situation here. Here we are. Yeah. Spin that. Good. Get that nice and slidey. <laughs> Good. All right. Now, <coughs> these guys in. Mm -hmm. Here. And spin you around and you go to this slot. Again, got to be have everything perfectly lined up. To... <laughs> Maybe get it to cooperate.
comes. Right. Yeah, that's how it's got. You know, sort of. There it went, I think. We'll finally got it. A little rub there. That so it still looks. Maybe it'll straighten out when I start putting more supports in. <laughs> and this guy. It's drawing my attention to something here. What's it drawing my attention to? Ooh, you know, no. That's, yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Yeah, this is a little more tapered on the bottom where this is rounded. I think that's what they're yeah, they're saying this is the top. So it goes in like so. Supposedly. Getting tight quarters here so it's hard to get. Would be one they should give spares to because that's a lot of pressure to be putting on that, but they did not. <laughs> okay, I can't. It's bad thing is, I just cracked it, but I'm gonna have to break it to make it work. <laughs> I gotta break it so I can fix it. Ooh, I hate that. Okay, well, it was hollow too, so that's that didn't help none. <laughs> okay. Get the old Gorilla Glue out. This out of the middle there. Mm. Mm. Spread it in all the little cracks and crevices, I hope. And they supposedly, I always heard. That this stuff is actually stronger than the wood once it's set. There's a. Give me a little more. Get this cleaned out here. So I can. I'm going to let that set up for 15, 20 minutes and I'll be back and we'll hopefully carry on. <laughs> okay. I think that's, it's still a little soft, but I think it's set enough to handle. Looks like it's pretty good. And after that, I am going, what fit in there? I'm going to go in and widen this up just a hair. Few strokes to make it a little bit better fit. And same on this one. Still, 
on this one. A little bit easier to hopefully get into place. <laughs> it didn't take much to... I'm going to start on the back. Yeah, and that was already much less effort required. Ooh. <laughs> also a little bendy there, too. <laughs> okay, let's see if I can get anything in there. This one. I'm going to break it putting it on there. I think I am. <laughs> oh, well, if I do, I'll just glue it again. Okay. It's on there. And I think I say it's it's a little bendy, <laughs> but I think it's gonna be straight enough. Ooh, you know what? I just realized the next step. <laughs> May end up breaking it anyway, because I'm about to pull these rubber bands back and rest them on this thing. Oh, not with that one though. The one that came with the set. Alright, let's see how this goes. Yeah, that's very wiggly. Okay, let's... Yeah, and actually it may... That may, may be what I want, really. If I can get that... I may go give this another 15 or 20 minutes if I can get... You the hook. Get you. Ooh, there it went. No, it's not gonna stay like that. Okay. 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 I'll leave that in place this time. <laughs> I said, I jumped the gun on it. I should have waited a little bit longer. Okay. But I'm going to leave those pieces in place this time, so it's got something to go against. Yeah, I don't have to worry about trying to make it fit a little excess, maybe. Now, you... End up in there. Okay. I'm not going to worry about wiping the a little wiggle there, a little push, a little pressure. Okay. Now I've got to, got to leave it alone. Nice little. Get on there. Okay. Now i got to leave it alone to let it set up. So I'm going to give it a solid 35, 40 minutes this time. Make sure it's good and set before I try and go again. So, I'll be right back with that. That didn't take long, did it? <laughs> Alright, it's been about 30 minutes. And I was looking. And the next two... If I do my steps out of order, I can actually get a little reinforcement here. So, that's what I'm going to do right now. Because these... I got... These go on either side, and so that would reinforce this, the support there if it's all tied in together, I hope. So I'm hoping I can do that. Okay. Without breaking it again. It's, uh, these. Okay. Almost there. <laughs> Okay, you're in. Okay, get you locked in place there. Okay. Okay, I think I did bend it there, but then it went back in place once I put the second one in. <laughs> That, like I say, that will do that. And this over here, 
that should give us a good solid two are holding that one in place. Now the trick's going to be to get the rubber band through there with that. <laughs> but I think I've got the tool for it. I'm lucky. time I'm going to do them both at the same time so I don't stretch one out the, too far. <laughs> I hope are you both hooked in there? Yeah. definitely been <laughs> held in place at this point so I'm almost tempted to let that let it sit like that can I do let me look and see <laughs> and we're gonna have clearance after uh no I gotta do this Just do all the pieces with there no I gotta do it beforehand okay <laughs> so now to get these guys one at a time into these notches. So I'll get to undo that. And nope, I just lost it. Okay. <laughs> Again, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Right, let's try. There we go. Just need three pairs of hands and two tools and <laughs> you which one are you for? Okay, so that goes all the way back to the beginning again too. <laughs> One done. <laughs> now, see if I can do this one any a better job of this one. Okay. Slipped. 
Okay. Nope, missed. Well, he's got to be a one wise guy. Okay, let's lay you across that. There it goes. Okay, so now. Color in place and hold the nut. That's gonna twist up our gear, so whenever it lets go, it'll put that on as little stress as possible there. <coughs> okay. Now, take this guy, and I'll stop after this one because this will pretty much make it look like a get to the biplane. Okay, and I am staying clear of my beam there. <laughs> I hope. Okay. Learned my lesson from last time. Let's make a little more space there. And here, just in case. <laughs> yeah, that works better. Okay, that seems like a good place to stop. Don't want to push my luck too far with this glue. I'm pretty sure it's set good, but I don't think I don't. I, say I don't want to push it. Yeah, because it's still a little. It's not quite hardened yet. It's a little squishy. But I say that's all going to be held in place with all these other pieces. So that's I feel good about that. All right, but. We'll finish this up tomorrow. In the meantime, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe, comment, complain, share. Do whatever you want to with all of that. Be good to one another. Stay safe, and I'll see you next time. Bye.